Here, you, you can sit on the chair, the fancy chair. <gasps> Thank you. I know it's a lot different from the chair we just came from, but one problem right now we have at shopping district is that yeah. there's no roads. And me and Crit had an idea. You get to finalize the, all the ideas for shopping district. Uh huh. Um, that basically, uh, our idea was that everyone kind of gets a certain area, like I don't know, like fifty by fifty, where we all build roads. And it could be whatever we want, but everyone is allowed to build a shop wherever, as long as it's like not on the road, obviously. Yeah, um, within that area. Uh, like everyone can build a shop wherever they want, but like uh, you get your own area to build your own road. So like, it's like, let's say I want to do futuristic, I can do futuristic, but someone can come along and build whatever they want in my futuristic road. As long as, uh, but like, you know, you should, probably should try to build futuristic shops in the futuristic area. If that makes sense. Yeah. And everyone, everyone on the server would get a area to build. That's important. <gasps> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> It's honestly kind of cool how you already know like when my uh, hunger bar is going down and you like instantly just give food. Oh, really? Yeah, you just every time, every time you've given me food, my, my hunger's gone down even just a little bit. I feel really small down here. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, so where's like the heart of, food. where's the heart of the, um, where, where are we going to be making the mayor thing? Uh, it's honestly up to you. Okay, well, I want this would... island area. You want you want it to be on this island? Yeah, this tiny little area. Like, we can just make it on stilts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, a, that's a cool idea. Um, what is it? You know, honestly, I associate you with, like, all the cute things, because, like, <gasps> that's, that's kind of, like, on brand for you. Yeah. <laughs> so it's like, like it's, you know, your your face is like all this little cute, like mushrooms and like all this, and then you have your industrial dance trick, but that's yeah. Um, yeah. So yeah, it's like you know, you can do all that, and then we can build like if we want. If you want, we could build like a pink town hall thing. Honestly, or, or, um, I don't mind what the walls look like as long as the roof is pink. <laughs> yeah, so it's like that'd be that'd be cool. Um, what else is there? So like, you'll make the rules for the shopping district. Like, if you wanted to, you could say no flying the shopping district. Um, as long as it kind of makes sense and is like is capable of doing. Yeah. Um, and then like you could say like uh. Like, and I think what will happen is we'll have chosen be the, um, we'll have him be the sher sheriff. And if he catch, if we catch someone breaking the rules, we'll find them. And then that will go to, um, the town hall, uh, diamond pile. Yeah. And then you can use the diamonds for whatever you want. How, how would the diamonds, like, be used up, though? Like, do you mean, like, I just spend them on, like, materials and those materials go towards the, sh the shopping district? If you want, you could also do competitions and stuff, and you could do, and, like, offer, uh, you know, because, like, obviously right now, if we come over here, we have this, um, temporary, like, diamond pile with the one diamond block that I put. Yeah. Um, and, like, so, like, let's say... Right now, there's a competition. You can spread it, uh, and like, let's say the best road competition. I'm totally not thinking of Hermitcraft. Um, <laughs> and like, you know, uh, winner gets uh, like all the diamond block, or like, first place gets five diamonds, second place gets three diamonds, and last place gets, or third place gets one diamond. Yeah. Or something like that. You could do competitions. You know, you control this area. You would control this area, and you know, as as a part of the e client, we could kind of, you know, be the voices behind, from behind, you know. I, we, I see, we, I see, yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Yeah. And if you wanted to, you could put a law saying, um, protect all sheep <laughs> in the shopping <laughs> district. So, you know, you can literally make the shopping district however you want, pretty much. Okay, okay. Uh, do you have a sign? Do you have a sign I can put up? And I, uh, because it fits with the, um, with how it was going, you know, you gotta, you gotta take from the village. Yeah. Uh, here you have three. Thank you. So, these were some to, uh, to do things that me and Crick came up with, you know, build a spawn, build roads, build shops, build uh, the nether hub. Rule one. All shops. Oh, God, hang on. Wait, 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 you're not married yet. Hang you on. Know, Must want to keep be this... bunny safe. Oh. Oh, you like bunnies? Absolutely, they're adorable. Okay, but you know, that that can be a sh that can be a rule if you wanted it to. Bunny safe can be I'm anything as long like if there's a bunny in the shop and the bunny doesn't die within three minutes, then it's set bunny safe. All right, I'm gonna have to destroy this cause, so then. You know, th no one knows that. That there's. I'll just like there might be some sp suspicious activity. There we go. Um, but yeah, and then like you, uh, you know, this is kind of a to-do board for everyone, but eventually you will have control over what gets put on the to-do board. You can also change it if you want. <gasps> that doesn't have to be there. Just gonna. Where is I think it? that makes it look so much better. Uh, oh yeah, that does look good. <laughs> Little bunny head. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> so you're okay with being mayor, right? Yeah. I also, mean, yeah, it's not like I have to be the executioner where I go after people and do boop. Oh, yeah, that's okay. chosen. Yeah. Um, because yeah. another reason we picked you is that no one really dislikes you. Like, yeah, <gasps> I you like hearing that. People. Yeah. You don't have any bad beef with anyone. Like, no one has... You haven't really done anything to anyone. Like, yeah, you put pufferfish in certain people's spaces, but that was, like, it. Yeah, that's that's honestly the worst I can think of. I don't really, th like, you know, like doing terrible pranks on people. Yeah. Um, so it's like, you know, you have that. Brit, like, you know, he's, he's done some stuff. Um, he's annoyed Lindsay and you know, Lindsay has a couple friends on the server, and Chosen, well, it's Chosen. Um, <laughs> so that's going to be the hard part, but that's up to Crit to get him to be Sheriff. Or wait, I think maybe if you become mayor, you can appoint whoever is the Sheriff. I, I don't know like, everything plan of it, because, you know, me and Crit don't have the same mind, but... You know, we could just rename him Executioner. Yeah, we could. <laughs> Boing. Boing. I have my bed back. Boing. Yes. <laughs> my bed now. Oh, my bed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm really happy we turned this into a bunny. Okay, that, that's my day done. <laughs> See ya. <laughs> um, okay. Something e cladding we decided is that, um, so basically. Whoever helps out with the shops gets um, gets a part of the profit of the shop that they helped out on. Yeah. So, like for example, the slime shop. Unfortunately, you did not help out on it uh, because I kind of only invited Crit with it. Yeah. And that's how we kind of became like Eclat. Yeah. Um, and like, so it's only me and him that are getting profits out of this. But you know, the Guardian Farm. You know, you've yeah. been helping out a lot with that. So. Yeah. You're gonna get profits out of the shop that we make eventually out of that. Yes. I honestly just wanted to hang out, man. <laughs> uh, also, so the first thing that I think that we should do, um, if we want to get ready for like roads and stuff, I really do think. Like, are there any more villages around here? No, there's no villagers. Then we should just raise this place to the ground. All right. Sounds simple enough. 
Because at the very least, we can use these resources for the rest of the town. Yeah, we could. We could put it in a chest and be like, uh, previous inhabitant. Uh, do you have any silk touch or are we just going to break the panes? I have silk touch. Okay. I'll leave all the panes for you then because I forgot my silk touch. <laughs> oh, really? I always carry silk touch. Yesterday was a fun stream. I think. <laughs> oh, you made it that much better. I was honestly struggling. Oh, yeah. yeah. I, I, I was just like, oh my god. Is she really struggling this badly? Let me just go help her. <laughs> yes, please. Thank you. Okay, so with me, I okay. So with the uh, like with advanced things, I don't struggle with. But the moment you you say, "Oh, easy collection system," I'm like, "Okay, let's do all of these very, very, very advanced, tricky things," and then none of it works. <laughs> You're struggling to remove water. Uh, that water is an advanced thing. It's an advanced mechanic in Minecraft. <laughs> I'll let you believe that. <laughs> Alright, well, in all seriousness, um, like, even in real life, um, so, my, my parents found this out the hard way. Um, whenever they'd put, like, um, a really difficult math question in front of me, I'd be able to answer it really quickly. It's like putting a Sudoku in front of me. I I can do really, really difficult Sudokus. But the moment you put something easy in front of me, like a word search, oh, no, that, that's <laughs> when it gets hard. That's, that's I spend, like, an actual hour doing an easy child word search, but, like, five minutes on a Sudoku. What is it? Um, I always like would get out of doing word searches because i would always say they gave me headaches which i mean to an extent they did but not always that's a really good way to get out of them <laughs> it's just getting out of them. also uh because i'm diabetic like uh i would get out of uh swim class um because like in in my school they would uh what they did was like with the chlorine they would like just like overflow it with chlorine yeah and it was just awful. Um, so, you know, I like nobody wanted to swim. So whenever, like, uh, whenever we were doing something that I didn't really want to do either, um, I would be like, oh, my blood sugar's low because I'm diabetic. So it's like, uh, it's dangerous for me to be in the pool because I could just pass out at any mo moment. Which I mean, true, but uh, not the real reason. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think the hardest thing would be like, um, what's it called, uh, mossy cobblestone because you actually have to get vines, which is is even that hard in general because we have a lot of jungles on the server. I broke the only two blocks that fell down into a very large void. <laughs> Wait, void? You mean ravine? Void. <laughs> Just for the extra confusion. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> How long have you been playing Minecraft, by the way? Uh, like, since I first started. Yeah. Um, you know, like, I think it was maybe a week before 1.8 came out. Oh, okay. Yeah. So pretty long. Ironically enough, I just- I still feel like a noob. Constantly. Fair. Like, every time I log in, it's just always a new game. Like, it just- it always feels like a new game. Um... Yeah, updates make the- I feel like, though, that's what, uh, is making Minecraft stay popular. Yeah. Because it's not, like, you know, if they didn't update it, it we'd be pretty burned out of it by now. No, like, even without the updates, um, it just, it always felt like a new game to me because, um, I was always learning something new from it. Oh yeah, like yesterday, you learned more about the ice. Yeah. So. Alright, I need a place to dump all this stuff I have. You need me to make a chest? Yeah, could you? Oh, yep. I'm a running. I'm a running. And uh, here, so there, there. Uh, 
here. Oh, you want to see something really cool? Sure. Okay, so you can do this and then this and yeah. then this and then this. Yeah. I didn't know you could do that. <laughs> I thought you like because if you touched another block and you right and you shifted right click, it, it would be its own separate chest. Like I'll show you, like that. Oh, and okay. Like I that. know what you're talking about. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's been a thing <laughs> since like 1.13. Yeah, it, it's it's actually taken me until like recently to figure that out. <laughs> Let me just also, I think uh, Crit is gonna work on a um, raid farm. Oh yes, because I, I talked to him about it, and um, him and I um, agreed to make it into a community raid farm. Oh okay. Because like we don't really need emeralds and totems of undying. It's like eh. Well, we can make shops for it, so. True. Also, I feel like one rule of the, of like when we um eventually do uh, all the roads is that they have to be spawn proof. So like no mobs can spawn on it. Are there any mushroom um, islands? I don't think so. And I was talking to Crit about this. I might have to expand the world border. <gasps> yes. <laughs> I hear that and Are I'm like, yes. Why do you guys care so much about banning the world border? Um, mostly because if um, it's beyond 10,000 kilometers, we have a potential to find um, um, mansions. And I oh. love finding mansions. It's one of my favorite things. See, the world is 10k by 10k, so. No, but like from spawn, it has to be more than 10k's out. Oh, okay. I did not know that. Yeah, constantly learning. It's a great experience. <laughs> My head hurts. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kind of um, wondering what kind of shop like I'd build, um, because I hadn't really thought about like the like what my shops would actually look like. Well, it's like, what are you gonna sell? Is the thing. Uh, gunpowder. So I was probably gonna end up doing creeper head or something. See, as like th that's a. It's basic, and it, it would be nice, but it's all at the same time, you know, it's basic. Yeah. So, I mean, it's up to you, but like, you could do something cooler, I feel like. I could, and that's what's bothering me. I'm like, oh, should I, should I not? I want to see what other people are building before I kind of like, do what I want to do, like that kind of thing. You could build like a dynamite if you sell a uh, gunpowder. Oh, and then I can like sell what like that gunpowder makes like dynamite or rockets. Yeah. Like a dynamite stick, you know uh, what I'm talking about? Like they use in cartoons and stuff. Yeah. I don't know if they look like that in real life or not. Uh, I think there is a design for them to look like that, but it's not now. Like these days we just use a grenade. Yeah. Well, no, grenades are more um, for war. Dynamites are more for like mining. Uh, they use mining machines now for that. Well, dynamite is more for like, you know, destruction yeah. of things, and war is for like, and grenades is for like, um, you know, hurting people. Yeah. Because of the way they're built too. Yeah. Like their shells and stuff, and the shrapnel that, um, that gets like, spewed out. Yeah. Whereas dynamite, I don't think it, like pretty much any shrapnel is. Out, goes out. I want to use materials from like the uh, original village to make the uh, mayor's manch, uh, mayor um, thing, the town hall. That'd be cool. That'd be a fun challenge too. You do know we'd be adding the diamonds into there. Yeah. Would you want the diamonds like in the open and like everyone can see you or would you like it in a vault? Um, I think that we should have it out in the open, but like under a glass case. Oh, okay. And then we, do you want like a way in there without having to break the glass, like a vault door or something? Yeah, with a password. 
Do you know how to do right. that? Uh, I, I okay. I can work on that. I don't have an exact design. Now I'll record this if you want to uh, put this in. Um, you know. Yeah. Uh. I'm still recording. I, I didn't. I didn't I stop recording. Yeah. But um. So. I'm also gonna share my screen. Um. Screen. Screen. Hopefully. I'm recording it right now, so. Okay. I can send you the file. All right, so this is just a three by three door, see? Yeah. And we can cover it too, so it's like, that's all you see. Yeah. And then, or we could do a two by two, which is much smaller and way faster. So yeah. Yeah. And both of them are password, can be password protected? Um. I would have to work something out, but yeah. Huh. I feel like though it would have to be like, it could be an easy password for us, but it's like like to, you know, like, uh, a nine button thing. Yeah. Um. Although I'm pretty sure you'd have to punch it in like, um, like you know, fast, but like you know, it's not like, it's like you would have like three seconds to punch in a four digit code or something if you wanted yeah. to. Or like however many digits you wanted it to. Because I think that I know how that I would work that. Yeah. So. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm bad at conversation. <laughs> yeah, same. Hello, sheep. It's telling you what a bad idea this is. <laughs> oh my goodness. I guess you went over the moon. I stop. <laughs> I make the sounds for the baby gremlins and they look at me like I'm the best thing since sliced bread. <laughs> <laughs> Me and Crit are planning on doing a, uh, like, okay, so I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have Crit, like, uh, edit all of it, but, like, basically we're gonna make a little stupid, uh, scene thing where we have chosen beating, uh, an invasion of aliens. <laughs> <laughs> and it's gonna be, like, all edited, it's gonna be, like, one of those crappy 80s movies. Wait, like, in Minecraft? Yeah, in Minecraft. <laughs> wow, man, you're really tired. <laughs> I carry a bed on me. <laughs> so prepared. <laughs> this is efficiency five, and it's still taking actually forever. Do you need help? <laughs> um, for this house probably not, but can you get like that last house over there? There's a couple more things that I'm doing, actually. Oh, what are you doing? Where are you? Because there's a couple, I mean like there's a couple like of those stands. I didn't oh. even see these stupid cobblestone blocks. It's like behind trees and stuff. They hid themselves from us. They knew our plan. Okay, I'm gonna be like... completely real with you. Um, the main reason um, I wanted to help you with the Guardian Farm was to see how it was done because um, I, I contemplated do it, making one because I think there's another temple somewhere um, that, I, that I passed further south. Um, or maybe that's further, I can't remember. I think I went east or something. But I found another temple and I was like, should I make one? I'm really contemplating making one. Um, but I really didn't want to have to go through all the drama by myself. And you you could see for just my cactus farm how difficult it was. So um, And that's an easy farm too. Yeah. <laughs> and, um, so Honestly, I'll, like, I would have built a much simpler cactus farm if I were you. Like, you mean the collection system? Just everything in general. Just everything. 
Because, like, you made it, like, way more difficult than it had to be. <laughs> um, yeah, that, that sounds about right. That, that sounds par for the course. Oh, more cobble. Oh, where? Uh, over here. Oh, I didn't see that. Oh, mossy stone. Uh, I got trolled by the building. Oh, F. I always forget about strip logs. Strip logs are really, really, really nice. I think one time I built like this Japanese kind of build, like base design. It was so pretty. And do you know why, why I liked it so much? Cause, use strip logs. Yeah, because I used the strip logs. And there was this one person who moved in, um, like near me, and he used strip logs for the um, border around his place. It was so bad. It was so bad. And Aww. I said that in the nicest way possible. It was just, no, you don't use them that way. And I'm, I'm like, no. Oh dear. What? There's a tree that I need to fell down from the top because otherwise it's just a floating tree. And I'm like, no. Refuse. Oh, here, I got it. Uh. Nice. <laughs> did, did we... Is there, like, a... An ender chest around here? Uh, I can place one down. Oh. Temporarily. Good, good guy, Bronzy. Coming for the win. I don't have any silk touch, so it's not like I can steal it. Well, like, I have it inside my ender chest because, um... I never bothered putting mending on it. And I have a mending villager, it's just that I never bothered using it. Oh yeah, I have mending villager as well. Where are you? Over here. Here. Thank you. Oh. Sorry, I just love using the fishing rod for that. I think it's funny. Where did I put my... No, I think it's in the shulker box that I put, um... Oh no, I left all of it at the um, cap in at the cactus farm. Ooh. <laughs> what do you need? Uh, do you have one piece of paper? Uh, I do have my base. <laughs> Never mind, it's fine. I'll leave that there, leave that there. I mean, like, the base right over there. Yeah. With the iron farm. Um, two fireworks. Honestly, I think that's enough to get me back to my base. Let me just check the OBS map. Oh yeah, that's definitely enough. Yeah, this is only about 300 blocks away. Yeah. Okay, so where is my base? It's this way. Yep. Oh, wait. I wasn't wearing my, uh, elytra. <laughs> okay, so this is south. Yep. Oh. You should okay. build a honey farm. Honey farm? Uh, how do I do that? Uh, you need bee nests, uh, which you can, uh, kind of generate with, uh, poppies. Yeah. And growing a oak sapling, um, into a tree and you can bone meal it and stuff. Yeah. Um, so if you need poppies, just drop by my, uh, iron farm. Yeah. And, um, wait, so what can I do with a honey farm, though? Uh, make honey blocks, uh, and, you know, you get the honey bottles. And those turn into food, kinda. But they're not good food. Huh. But the honey blocks are very useful. I would buy from you. Okay. Oh, find my friends. I guess you found all the friends. Yep. Then I killed them all. <laughs> Did you enjoy um, the little find my friends thing, though? No. <laughs> I had fun putting them there. I, I hope you know that. That's... <laughs> I still, I think my favorite video of yours was, uh, Two Geniuses at Work. <laughs> yeah. That might seem a little, like, um, what's the word? I don't know the word, but, like, you know, because I'm in it. Yeah, yeah. It, it was, 
it was just so funny. <laughs> this is my mom doesn't mm, love you. <laughs> That's my favorite part. <laughs> um, I showed my mom that part, and my mom she was drinking water at the time, and she spat out her water, and even she laughed at the reference. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> I mean, she laughed as soon as I explained that none of us are actually related and that we're just role-playing. Yeah. Oh god, uh, no, 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 go back up. Okay, we can do this. We can- we can learn how to fly. Okay, eventually. <gasps> we did it! I like how I got to- Oh, uh, you're base faster than you. <laughs> <laughs> I, I've used up, like, I had to use my last rocket just to get myself to the cre uh, creeper farm. Ah. Uh, you have a lot of stuff up here. <gasps> my last two stacks of rockets. Well, I say my last two stacks of rockets. I have to go check if um, any more. Um, sure, can, yeah. I'm gonna make a giant. Um, I don't know if you were watching that part of. No, I don't think. I think yeah, I put it in a recording, but I never. Um, posted the recording so what's gonna happen is I'm gonna um, make a giant uh, building behind this so this is the front this is the front how, how pretty it looks but the they're gonna the um, these observers are gonna be a set of timers and um, they're each gonna oh. have yeah well, are you gonna make it a hopper clock uh, no why not? Well, like, aren't the, aren't the observers kind of like the clock? And, like, once they um, activate the redstone at the back, and then it's going to have a flying machine that goes back and forth. Oh, okay. I thought, uh, I thought you're, like, I thought you were going to keep it like this, but then, like, have a clock that pushes all the pistons. Oh, uh, no, no, no. Um, the, like, they're going to, the, the, what you see at the front is just a front. It's actually, like, the, the observers, this part is actually the clock. Yeah, but then you're, are you going to, like, expand it down? Yeah, or? I'm going to expand it that way. And, like, you don't see what's actually inside of it. Like, what's inside of it is just probably going to be a bulk of um, terracotta. But, yeah. Yeah, I, I see. You got, are you also going to make a bamboo farm like that? Uh, should I? It's up to you. Bamboo is, eh. It's only used for fuel and, uh, like, fueling rockets. Or not rockets, furnaces, and um, scaffolding. And signs. I usually use them to make signs. Oh yeah, they can also be used to make sticks and stuff. Yeah. Um, hmm. The thing is, just like, you know how you said uh, bamboo was like meh? Me? Like, that's my view on all farms. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah, I love to explore and like, oh, there's more dying. So like, you know how like messy everything looks? Yeah. Th that That's why. <laughs> Honestly, this is nicer than all of my farms and all of my farms were supposed to look nice. <laughs> how many eggs have we gotten? As soon as like the third um thing is filled you with eggs. Hit, hit, hit. Like, you know, if you're not in the, like in the area, it won't work, right? Yeah. I yeah, think, so. yeah, I've been AFKing around here, like, I've then, like, put, like, a piece of glass on top of me so the phantoms can't get me, and, um... What I think you should do is make an AFK chamber. Wait, no, you did, up here. Yeah, up here. Does, would that work, um, to make the eggs go? I'm pretty sure? Oh, I tried to... I don't have my elytron, hang on. However, if you just stay down there and build a little glass thing, uh, the farm, your creeper farm will work. Your sugarcane farm should work, and your chicken farm should work. Not sure about the cactus, so it's a little bit far. Flying is so amazing. <laughs> How much is the uh, is the gunpowder? Uh, three diamonds for a stack, right? Yeah. Right. Good price, isn't it? Yeah, because it's basically a stack for rocket. Yeah. <laughs> or a rock, or a diamond per stack for rock, rock, say. Um, but if you uh, included the um, what's it called? Pet. 
paper, sugarcane. So like, then it would be um, two diamonds per stack of rockets. Yeah. But I have my own sugarcane farm, so I don't need it. Yeah. But also, people like I'm... Lindsay. Oh. <laughs> I'm I'm not sure. But I feel like your sugarcane farm is actually slower because of how much sugarcane you have. What do you mean? Okay, so like mechanics in Minecraft are weird. And especially with growing cro crops, like, oh my god, it's so weird. Like, so you might think it's the best to have like 64 blocks long of like pumpkins for pumpkins um, in, in one straight line and then have them all uh like grow onto a uh, block that is like a regular block um but it's like you would actually want to make a diamond pattern or something because that makes it grow the fastest so it's like it's just oh my god but wouldn't that make um oh jesus um like if it's in a diamond pattern would that mean like it's um inefficient because like it's two um little vines that could potentially grow see no, no no what i'm saying is that the pumpkins will grow faster like they'll like be there faster than if uh than if like we if you had uh, uh something like this and i'm just using pumpkins as an example yeah um is it pretty this yeah yeah. <gasps> yeah. <laughs> Someone put a I... stone block here. Huh. They thought I wouldn't notice. That might have been me. <laughs> I, I, I just love this farm in particular because, like, Okay, so you know this um, this system works at like the normal way I was building it. Yeah. What works at the uh, slime farm I have. Yeah. <laughs> but then here it's just like nah. <laughs> and then me and Crit argued for like thirty minutes on why it wasn't working. You guys really did wait. I gotta just check. Uh, how many views do I have on that particular video? Uh, let me just channel videos. Um, no restrictions. Five views. Honestly, that's not too bad for me. That sounds so sad. It's not that bad, okay? Everyone yeah, likes yeah. it. <laughs> You're, oh god, not the fish. You got 11 views. Your short, uh, your Skyward short's gone wrong. Got 511 views. Oh, uh, yeah, um, the shorts, it's because, okay, so there's this thing with YouTube, right? They're actually, like, promoting hashtag shorts. Huh. Yeah, so I posted, I posted another, um, uh, shorts. It's for Among Us, though, and I want to see, like, it takes about two, three days for it to, like, blow up. But once it blows up, it blows up. And, um, you just need to have hashtag shorts in the description. Uh, description or the title, but I've put it in the description, the title, and the tag, so just in case. Oh, okay. But yeah, YouTube is heavily promoting them to keep up with um, Instagram and all that. Makes sense. I was just guy taking Damien. Well, he's dead now, but. Like... <laughs> I just love the fact that, like, since, you know, you're, I think your primary source of food is chicken. Yeah. I always think you killed a lot of these. What makes you say that? <laughs> okay, so I have to let you in on a little secret. I wait until these guy guys get a full double chest of eggs. And then I kill yeah. the ones in here, and then I re I repopulate it. But because it's a full double chest, I end up with more chicken anyways. You know you can make a fully automatic chicken farm, right?
Like, you, they literally will lay eggs and then dispenser dispense it and stuff. And... Yeah, but that, that's that's specifically for chicken's job. But chicken is over there and I'm over here. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. I see. Chicken is precious. I haven't visited her in like two, three weeks, but she's precious, all right? So I have a question. Yes. What are you going to do with this once we do the thing we were planning to do with it in the first place? Um, I guess I'll just use it as decoration. <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing to really do about it. Like, yeah. I might like stack it up with like a cow things. farm and then on top of that a llama farm and then on top of that a bunch of sheep farms. That'd be so annoying because you'd have to get all the animals up there. <laughs> I, I have no idea what to do. A lot of stuff. Like, random stuff, too. Oh, yeah, it's still chaos. It's all, it's all a lot of chaos with me. Like, okay, well, okay think... if, you, if you go over here, if you go over here and, like, you look at this... It should, like, explain my personality. Including the drowned. Including the drowned. <laughs> Alright, well, I think I'm gonna get off on the... All right, so, you have a good one. Evening for you, I think. Uh, afternoon. Afternoon, whatever. <laughs> See ya. See ya.